In this video, we'll look at whether barium nitride, that's BA3N2, is ionic or covalent. So is this an ionic or covalent compound? The first thing we can do is look at barium right here. That's a metal. And then nitrogen right here, that's a nonmetal. Usually when we have a metal and a nonmetal, that's going to be an ionic compound. But we can also check the difference in electronegativity to see if that's the case. So again, we find barium, that's over here, 0 0.9, and nitrogen, 3.0. So we're looking at the difference in electronegativity. 3.0 minus 0 0.9, that's 2.1. So let's look at a scale to see if this Ba3N2 is ionic or covalent. So here's the scale. We have nonpolar covalent here, and on this side we have ionic. We said 2.1 was the difference between the bonds, between the barium and the nitrogen bonds. So that would be about right up here. So barium nitride, Ba3N2, is going to be an ionic compound. And because of that, the Ba3N2, this is what we call a formula unit. Barium nitride would actually be a crystal with repeating formula units of this Ba3N2. This is Dr. B answering the question whether Ba3N2, barium nitride, is ionic or covalent. It's ionic. Thanks for watching.